Lock him, head. I sit up. He sits back. I'm going to find that arm drag. Right? I missed it. Okay, I'll just put my hook back in. Now, he drops his weight back. I'm going to grab that lat. I'm going to rock to my back. I'm going to elevate his hips. Okay? As I elevate his hips, I'm going to extend my left leg and drop my other leg out and shrimp. I'm on his back. Okay? So I'm going to elevate his hips. Whatever side I'm holding on to, the other leg is going to extend. So then I fall to his back. Right? I'm already behind his shoulder. I just need to make enough space for him to fall off to that side. Right? So I hit my arm drag here, grab the lat. Okay? I throw my hips underneath him to elevate him up. I'm going to extend my other leg. Right? Switch my hips around me. Cool. Cool? If they put their foot on the ground, it makes it a little bit more. You've got to shrimp a little bit more. If they keep their feet in here, you'll fall right to that side. All right? So I arm drag, grab the lat, throw my hips forward and elevate, <clears throat> extend that leg, and as they fall towards that side, I should be able to get my second hook. Yes? This is what you would probably do if they like kind of sprawl into it when you try to do the original speed. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, if you can't load them up on top of you, that's fine. Throw your hips forward, get them up, right? And if you can't take them over, whatever reason, I'm just going to extend that leg. Whoop. It should be right up on their back. Yes? One, two. One, two, three.